During the process of our child letting my wife and I know uh, that he was trans, as parents we had many feelings. So one of those feelings was joy because we knew that he would be able to uh, flourish and thrive uh, in a way that he wouldn't have been able to had he not come out as, as trans. Uh, but one of those emotions was also fear. Uh, and we knew that most of the community would be amazing and supportive and the massive, uh, the massive attendance by folks against this absolutely garbage bill I think is evidence of that here today. And I'm so grateful for everybody who has and will, will speak against this. But we also knew that a small, angry, vile pocket of our community hates trans folks and hates trans kids. And we were right on both counts. But having parented an amazing trans child, the piece of data that matters the most to me and other parents is this, that according to the Trevor Project's 2023 survey, that half of trans and non-binary kids seriously considered suicide in the last year and that one in five attempted it. And because my colleague from the 97th seemed unable to find anything relating the effectiveness of gender-affirming care and suicide, I'll point him and many others to a meta-study literally called Suicide-Related Outcomes Following Gender-Affirming Treatment, colon, a review, and it concluded that of the 23 studies that met the criteria, the majority indicated a reduction in suicidality following gender-affirming treatment. So the idea that the science is not settled on this is frankly bullshit. I want to be clear, trans kids aren't considering or attempting suicide because of who they are, but because of who we are in this building right now. The authors of this garbage are responsible for trans suicides, for trans attempted suicides. It isn't the kids and their identities. It's a society in which actual adults sit down in a room and put pen to paper. I would call the authors ghouls and empty husks of people, but I won't because the authors of this legislation are not in this building today.